lost within snow-covered plains and down a long gravel road. There is an Air Force facility. It is a major artery of the U.S.'s nuclear deterrence program. Few have ever seen what happens within its gates. Yet for 24 hours, defense media activity was granted permission to tell this unique story. It's very rare that we get to put our story out there. Downstairs is where you could set the nuke off by the president's uh, approval. Now, there's no, you can't bring cell phones, keys, anything down there. During my crew time here, nobody's ever been allowed to take pictures for an actual visit. Um, so there's a lot of hoops to jump through just to be able to, to get you guys out here to, to kind of see what we do. I'm at Missile Alert Facility Juliet, located outside of Minot Air Force Base in North Dakota. And this, if you can believe it, is a mild winter. Deep underground, behind a thick blast door, sit two airmen, charged with the potential launch of up to 10 Miniman III intercontinental ballistic missiles. They stand ready, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Teams change throughout the week, but the mission stays uninterrupted, and the standard is nothing less than perfection. It's, it's uh, just in control of uh, 10 nuclear weapons. Um, anytime you're in control of something th this powerful, um, that's, it's, it's very much um, this, this pucker factor <laughs> that's, that's talked about. Absolutely. Um, it's just kind of slow, methodical processing. Um, every, we have checklists for everything. Um, follow the checklist, and, and they, they typically won't, won't lead you wrong. Above ground lives the support team, comprised of security forces constantly on watch to defend the mission. They have a pool table, a TV room, and a gym to relieve stress. And mm -mm. Th their own personal chef. Can't handle me. It's like a small community, and one airman is charged with the special duty position of being the facility manager. If I do my job right, the cops can do their job, the crew downstairs can do their job, and everything's good. We're a bunch of professionals out here. Um, everybody knows, knows the job that they're doing. They wouldn't be certified to perform this job with a nuclear weapon if they weren't um, capable of doing it. Our, our mission is not sitting here to launch. Um, hopefully we'll never have to launch. Um, and it's, it's the fact that we don't have to launch, and that's, that's what makes us so successful, um, that, that we're able and we're, we're willing um, if the president were to call us to do that. Whether it's the officers underground or the support team above, these airmen are the perfect example of how the best defense is a good offense. Reporting from Minot Air Force Base in North Dakota, I'm Staff Sergeant Chris Piles.